The Ascot Stairs Cup is next to this. It's two and a quarter miles. And at the top we've got Looney Tunes, the Ascot Gold Cup one again. They were two furlongs shorter today and going here instead of the Goodwood Cup for Paul Rhodes. Canada for John Morgan. Beam Craig Beck with Bobby Soxer. John Morgan. Daenerys Stormborn. Graham Clutterbuck. Darwin Starlet. Vinnie Gerard. Haraba Turk. David Robertson. Hybrid October. Graham Clutterbuck. Nine Lives. Joshua Sutherland. And Trouble Scene. Leon Van Rensburg. So another Group 1 winner dropping into a listed race then with a big penalty. And see what happens. Oh, here we go. It didn't work for the Derby winner earlier, or well, yesterday, so will it work for the Ascot Gold Cup winner today? Well, he's out of the stalls pretty sharply, but Beam is the leader. So Beam leads then. But Looney Tunes has come through to take it up. And he's in the lead. Obviously, Paul Rhodes thinks that the two-mile trip at Goodwood is too sharp for this one. And he's prepared to carry the penalty in this listed race, but it's Looney Tunes in the lead. We're on the hybrid October 2nd, and then nine lives after that one. With Daenerys Stormborn. Trouble scene is just towards the back of the field. With Looney Tunes in his bowls along in front. That's the winning post then with the circuit to go. And Looney Tunes in front by about four lengths. And try and make every Poster winning one. I think John Morgan has got a couple in this that maybe weren't in the Ascot Gold Cup, may have bought them in the transfer window. It'll be interesting to see because he's normally good at these distances. Anything else? You would think the only chance they've got is the weight penalty, but it's Looney Tunes. He absolutely annihilated everybody at the Royal Meeting and would be you probably the two things you look at and you'd say well maybe one of the newcomers is something special and it would have to be but from the John Morgan yard and a stain trip it could well be and then the other thing would be the massive penalty but it's Looney Tunes who doesn't seem to be worried about that penalty at the moment eight lengths clear of the nearest storm ball in second hybrid October is third and then Haraba Turk and then Nine Lives in Canada in trouble scene after that one. And Bobby Socks and Darwin Starlet and finally Beam. Uh, well past the halfway point and down towards the final mile then now. And Looney Tunes is well clear. Oh, Nine Lives in second. Hybrid October 3rd. Haraba Turk the ground the inside is fourth. Then Bobby Socks are in trouble scene. Darwin Starlet and Canada. And finally Beam at the back. Past the seven. And Looney Tunes is well clear. Of nine live second. In Highbury in October. With Haraba Turk still there on the inside. Canada just been dropped to the back now. And Looney Tunes just been pushed along a little bit to keep up the pace. The lead's definitely been cut down to probably about five now. Nine lives second, and now Nine Lives is making a forward move to come through to challenge this Looney Tunes as they begin the sweeping turn into the straight. Looney Tunes in the lead only by two. Two Nine Lives in second. Here comes Bobby Soxer on the outside, then Hybrid October and Haraba Turks after that one. But it's Looney Tunes who's still in the lead. Looney Tunes by a length. Two Nine Lives in second. Bobby Soxer heating up the ground up the centre of the track, then Haraba Turk and Hybrid in October. They're racing to the final two and a half furlongs, and Looney Tunes is still holding on in the lead by a length. Length. Two nine lives in second. Bobby Soxer is third. Then Haraba Turk and Highbury in October. Difficult to see anything else getting near these leaders. It's still Looney Tunes in the lead. Coming down towards the final furlong. And Looney Tunes is still two lengths clear. Looney Tunes in front from nine lives in second. Haraba Turk is next. Then comes Bobby Soxer and Highbury in October. And Looney Tunes is tiring, but he's still in the lead. Nine lives is coming. Haraba Turk is coming. Looney Tunes is beaten. And now four of them flash past the posting. And I think he was just. Nine lives that got up to take it. I think Nine lives may have just got back up to win that from Haraba Turk. It's close. Bobby Soxer looks like it's third. And horribly October 4th. That's definitely the white penalty did for Looney Tunes. As we take a look at the 
full list there. It's nine lives it takes you for Joshua Sutherland. Haraba Turk for David Robertson was second. Bobby Sox at John Morgan third. Hybrid October, Graham Clutterbuck fourth. And Looney Tunes with Paul Rhodes only fifth. But look at that to give away a stone and a pound to everybody else, which does seem rather a lot. And nine lives takes it though for Joshua Sutherland. <laughs> 